Adventure Family and welcome to another Adventure Family Worship Session. We're happy you joined us today. We have some adventurers from the Eastern District and some from other districts who will be telling us about being like a bird. Not to worry, but trust in God. So come, come along with us and fly with us into our worship session. Please, Jesus, help us to be well. Help that this night will be good for us. Help that our Pathfinder Venture meeting will be good for us. Help that um, at school, help that we will be listening. Help that every each of one of us, help that we will not get to miss this program of you, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. from Matthew 6, 25 to 27. Therefore, I tell you, do not worry about your life, what you will eat or drink, or about your body, what you will wear. Is not life more than food, and the body more than clothes? Look at the birds in the air. They do not, they do not sow or reap or, or, or store away in barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not much more than valuable than they? Can, can any can any one of you worry by worrying at a single hour to your life? Hello everyone. Today I'll be talking about the bald eagle. Did you know the bald eagle is not actually bald? It's actually known for its white head feathers and it's all, it also goes a long way back into Old English, where there was a word that it was B-A-L-D-E, -E, which means white. And did you also know, people call it king of the skies and ace of all birds. Some people think it's the most majestic bird of all. Sometimes it, it flies up to 30 miles an hour. That's really fast. And it can swoop down at 100 miles an hour. So if it wants to go somewhere it's like this, it wants to swoop somewhere like this. Okay? So that's really fast. And it has also been a national emblem since nine, since 1782. Scientists say that there are over 50 billion birds. Wow, that's a lot of birds, right? Can you name some birds? What do birds eat? What is your favorite bird? Bankton Seven Day Adventist Church. I am in Adventures Club, and today I will be naming some kinds of birds: blue jay, peacock, woodpecker, pigeon, robin, parrot, eagle, raven, dove, duck, goldfinch. Those are some of the different kinds of birds. God bless you all. Have a wonderful day. Hello everyone. Today I want to tell you 
who thinks about eagles? Eagles are from Mexico. Okay, let's start. First, eagles are eagles live from North America to the center of Mexico. The female, it means the girl eagle, measures one meter. And the male, that means boy, measures 87 centimeters. And they weave one to two legs. And they have only one partner in, the, in their whole life. Females, when they open their wings, they measure more than two meters. I forgot. Oops. And they eat rabbits, rats, and snakes. And they even eat animals that they're already dead. Okay, that's all the things cool that I wanted to tell you. Bye! Birds do not worry about what they eat. They simply find the food that God provides for them. They know that God knows them and what they need. Do you know that God cares about you and what you need to? Yes. We don't need to worry, but there's sometimes we do worry. What are some of the things you worry about? In life, we worry about different things. What chores we have, what our homework that we have to get done. But you know what? Paul sums it up in his writing in the Philippians chapter 4, verse 6 and 7. He says, don't worry about anything. Instead, pray about everything. Tell God what you need and thank him for all he has done and what he will do for you. Then you will experience God's peace. Your role is one, do not worry, two, always pray, and three, give thanks. When we walk closely with Jesus, he is there to carry our burdens of worry, anxiety, and fear. He lightens our load so that we can focus on serving him, living for him being able to tell others about him and preparing ourselves to live with him in heaven.
spending time with us. Happy Sabbath! Let's pray. Dear Father God, we thank you so much for providing for us so that we don't have to worry like the birds do. Let us carry our burdens and our cares and put them at your feet and never take them out there, Jesus. We pray that you'll be with all the adventurers and their families and bless the adventurer ministry throughout the world so that families can come to know you and boys and girls all over the world will get to know you and be closer drawn to you. This is our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen.